I feel like it's an interesting project to take on, take on, take on. I can't fight this feeling any longer and yet I'm still afraid to let it flow. I have a feeling this year will be busier for me but I'm going to face them with an optimistic mindset and a smile. I hear these songs I feel motivated. I feel lucky that if I have to get a tune stuck in my head while driving it involves Al Green crooning I get high I get high I get high. I just wonder and understand that maybe they did what they did to escape that empty feeling. I just want to feel like you love me. I can feel all the nutrients doing happy things and making me energetic again. I guess at the end of the day it all boils down to how you feel about your life on the inside finding those things that make you happy. I'm in a great place in my life and feel full of energy and optimism. I'm going to try to get out and about and have some of that fun that we weren't having all week while we were feeling crappy. I eat shitty food I feel shitty so why would I do that to myself? I think it's weird how I say how I feel and nobody takes me seriously. seriously. I imagine him crying softly to himself as he writes sad poetry about how I hurt his feelings, his feelings, his feelings, his feelings, his feelings, his feelings. I don't feel like writing much today. I feel compelled to follow through. I feel like saying why so serious. It's a, uh, uh, a, a celebration of communication and our, our technological ability to be able to uh, communicate every nuance of our lives with anyone else in the world. But at the same time, I think it's a uh, sort of a tongue-in-cheek poke at the fact that we're not actually doing anything with any of that information that we're throwing out there. The internet, you know, as, a, as an object, is, is sort of like a, a therapist that just sort of nods and doesn't actually give you any any advice back. It's just very, you know, g gestaltish <laughs> types, types of, you know, one-sided conversations.